Hello folks and welcome to Tooltech MD. I'm here with an unboxing of the Craftsman 4 inch belt sander in the 6 inch disc sander uh, tabletop here. Quick look at some of the features. Alright, let's crack her open. I'm going to remove the styrofoam now. Ah, there is the unit. Okay, so here's the unit. I'm going to go ahead and get started with assembly very shortly. Um, but real quick, I'll go over what comes in the box. So here we have the table. And this can be moved to both the disc and the belt portion of the unit. So that's good. We also get a miter gauge, and the table conveniently has a miter gauge groove. So that's cool. There you go, there's a miter gauge. This is a bracket, I believe, for the table. You're gonna get your, your disc. <laughs> and, of course, all the hardware included. Okay, here's the unit fully assembled. Really the only assembly required besides uh, if you wanted to mount it to your workbench, which you would do using the supplied brackets and these slots here, was attaching the table to whatever, wherever you prefer. Me personally, I'll be using the belt sander a lot more than the disc sander, so I put the table here, you can switch it back and forth pretty easily. All that requires is it taking out this knob and this knob, as well as the, uh, the lock bolt. So uh, we'll power it on real quick, make sure everything's working properly. Okay, so now to test it, I have this old turkey call I made a few years ago. And uh, this one, this side here isn't working properly, so I'm going to hit it with the sander. See how she performs. Alright, so it performs pretty well. I'm quite impressed with it, actually. Did a nice job. Plenty powerful, too. 
So yeah, that was my quick unboxing and demonstration of the Craftsman belt sander. Sanded down that turkey call. So far, really impressed with it. It had more power than I thought it would. Um, obviously, I'll be testing it even more, so stay tuned for that. But yeah, so far, our first impressions are good. So if you guys have any questions regarding assembly or any questions about the product at all, feel free to leave a comment. I'll get back to you. If you enjoyed the video, feel free to give a thumbs up and also consider subscribing. I have more videos coming your way. So I hope you guys enjoyed. Thanks for watching.